Welcome on board, Nozaris. This is certainly no ordinary ship, and these are certainly no ordinary crew members. This ship came all the way from Genoa and went through the Panama Canal and is now in the Pacific Ocean. The target destination of the IXV's recovery ship and its team of mission engineers is slightly north of the equator line, some two and a half thousand nautical miles west of Colombia's coasts on a circle 25 kilometers from IXV's target splashdown spot. We are inside the main deck of the Nosarius, the recovery ship of IXV. Our team is responsible for the naval station. The naval station is made by the telemetry system but it is also composed by a meteo station and we have also video recording equipment. Only a few days before the launch and on board, the clock has started ticking. Antenna, telemetry receivers, all systems need to be carefully checked and operations rehearsed. On February the 11th, the ship will release weather balloons to check the wind conditions over the Pacific and provide information on IXV's descent path. If weather and sea conditions allow, then IXV will be launched on top of a Vega rocket, sent 420 kilometers up into space before beginning a long glide back through the atmosphere. During this journey, Nosarius will receive the readings from IXV's 300 sensors. Our team will control the antenna, which is a two meter dish antenna from this position, point it toward the IXV, using the trajectory predicted by the Mission Control Center. And using the antenna, we will receive the uh, signal from the vehicle, uh, which will send us all the recorded uh, measurements made during the most important part of the flight. The ship's antenna will then pick up the beacon signals to locate the craft in the middle of the ocean. At the splashdown, first people that will reach the vehicle into the ocean will be the divers. The ship crew will bring us to the point where IXV will be floating into the ocean and then they will take care to retrieve the vehicle from the ocean, securing it on the main deck of the ship. Mission engineers will then retrieve the card, storing all data collected during the flight. A wealth of information that will help guide the design of future spacecraft bound to return to Earth.